in the end we have two sentinels guarding this Quran, al muawwadatain a very, very beautiful, you know, pair of surahs. And there is an opinion of Abdullah ibn Masood that actually these surahs are not part of Quran. They were revealed for treating Muhammad sallallahu when some Jew had done some sorcery against him. But the consensus of the Ummah is that they are a part and parcel of Quran. And my opinion, these two surahs are only the Madani surahs in this last group of Makki Madani surahs. In the first surah, only one surah was Makki, that is Surah Al-Fatiha. And Al-Baqarah, Al-Imran, Al-Nisa, Al-Maida, Madaniyat. This is the converse. From Surah Al-Mulk to Surah Al-Ikhlas, all Makkiyat, none Madani. And these two are Madani. All A'uzu bi Rabbil Falak. Say, I seek refuge with the Lord of the Dawn. Min Sharri Ma Khalaq. From all the evil of all that He has created. This is very noteworthy. Whatever is created is definitely incomplete. Completion is only for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. All creation has to be incomplete from one aspect or the other. And this aspect of incompletion adds to it some sort of shar, some sort of evil. So I take refuge of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala from the evil of everything that He has created. And from the evil of the darkness when it overspreads, because, you know, in the night the criminals are active, and so on, the jinns also, the evil spirits, as you call them. And from the evil of the blowers at the knocks, knocks, sorcerers, magicians, and from the evil of an envier, a jealous person, when his malignant envy is carried out in action, Hasidin is a hasada. When he is actively engaged in bringing his jealousy into action, translating it into practice. So these are the evils which befall human beings from without, outside. Now there is a very big evil which comes from within. And that is the subject of the last surah.